Yesterday, I feared my power. Today, I say yes to it and release it. I think far too many of us fear our power. I believe it comes from not understanding that our power is the manifestation of God in us, that if we truly believe our relationship with God is of a mutually abiding uh, benefit or awareness, then we cannot help but be all that he is and walk in all that he has promised. But that is scary. First, we have to get past believing what I just said is sacrilegious. I mean, God abides within, we abide within him. Our intimacy is then intricately connected. That doesn't mean we should be arrogant or pompous about it because God is neither. It doesn't mean that we behave like spoiled brats because God is not that. But it does mean we recognize that we have a divine power to talk some things into being, to bring to pass that which we intend to happen, to command angels in the very elements of the solar system and the universe and the earth to move at the sound of our voice, to, to, to declare that which is not yet to be what it will be right now. That is power. But that's intimidating because when we move in all of that, we bring forth the life that is already promised us. To begin to, see, to say yes to our power means we have to realize that every experience has come to give more oomph to what is already there. It means you have to acknowledge that you've had some juice all along. Scary junk, right? So we sort of kind of have faith. We sort of kind of affirm some things. We sort of kind of exercise our divinity. We sort of kind of open ourselves up to love. But then we realize we have to learn ourselves. We have to learn to love ourselves first so we pull back. Well, I for sure enough real got to the point where I no longer wanted to live in sort of kind of, but instead live in my power daily. When we say yes to our power, we unleash our divine selves into the earth realm to wonderfully impact not only our life, but the lives of others. That's a pretty all right thing to do. Today I say yes to my power and yes to the love, wealth, peace, vibrancy, vision, and more that it can bring. All you got to do is say yes, yes, yes. I'm Emily Claudette Freeman. Be sure to interact with me through Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, coaching programs, books, and so much more. Get the details at www.eclaudetteliterary.com.